fish! This is bizarre! Come on! I need to investigate! Thanks for the love! These are large predatory fish called trevally. It says here that they usually eat squid, crabs and other fish. I don't want to add myself to that list. I'd better get back to normal size. Whew, I'll be safe now, but I'm not sure about the young terns. It looks like these trevally have learned to leap out of the water to try and catch them whilst they're learning to fly. Maybe that's what happened to Jen's camera. It flew too close to the water and a trevally grabbed it. it. Must be on the surface. Come on. Now, where's that camera? Oh no, it's my young friend. He's landed in the water. If he doesn't get airborne again soon, he's going to end up as fish food. I need to warn him. Oh, there's no time to rest. You need to fly. Remember? Like this. Go on. You can do it. Keep going. You're nearly there. I was close! It looks like he's got the hang of flying now. He and the other young turns will be safe way up there. Right, where did that bird cam get to? Ah, there it is. I'd better go and grab it before a trevally does. Ah, ah, got it! Ah, I'd better call Jen. Jen, I found your bird cam. You'll never guess what happened to it. What, Andy? It was knocked out of the sky by a leaping fish called a trevally, who mistook it for a real sooty turn. Wow, I never knew a fish could do that. Neither did I. Right, I'm relaunching it for you now. You should be getting a signal any moment, Jen. Thanks, Andy. If I fly it a bit higher than before, then hopefully it'll be safe from any more acrobatic fish. Good idea. And just in time, Mr. Hammond's talk is about to begin. I'll start the live stream straight away. And I'd better head back to the safari, sir. See you later, my feathered friends. Remember to fly high. Let's all go on an interpretic adventure.